hope you are good uh, so in this video i will show you how the reports dashboards and uh, the attendance and the uh, video is working so i have implemented the functionality of the page where all the class offerings and global offerings you can see on a single page so that you can directly uh, take the attendance by clicking on just a button uh, besides that particular class offering so i have logged into the production file right now and i have created some demo uh, contacts that those are basically the students that those are test contact one and test contact two so i am uh, creating one dummy uh, class offering as well so that i can show you how the track attendance will work so let me create one class offering i will delete this after uh, uh, after this particular video session so i am just creating a new class offering and our class offering id is 0024 so now let, let's add uh, to uh, these students basically that we created earlier uh, let me put them as test contact one and so let's let's class in progress so let's also one create one more class uh, connection that is um, it's basically the faculty let me choose like the student so this time I am choosing it as this contact two. so here you can see the two uh, class connections are created so as you know we have the button over here as soon as you click on the mark attendance button uh, you will get the screen where you can mark uh, select the particular staff or the volunteer from the list of uh, uh, from the list of contacts and you just need to click on submit so this is the one way so right now i have implemented one more page that is basically the track attendance so this track attendance is the basically the tab which can be also uh, which can, you can get it from this particular section as well or you just need to click on student management screen and then there you will get the second tab that is the track attendance so it's currently loading so here you can see there is a tab called track attendance so these are uh, so if you look into the home screen there are the two sections class of doing attendance and event of doing attendance so these are basically the reports so currently we don't have the data that's why it's not showing any chart because the, there's no data for offering attendance present for the class offering and the event offering so let's go to the track attendance page so on this page this is basically the page i have created after the second order uh, here you will get all the class offerings present in the system along with their respective class name the academic term term started and ended as well so here you can see the action the action is basically this is the button so uh, so our class offering was 0024 so uh, if i if you if particular sales or the sales rep or the employee wants to track attendance for this particular class offering he need to click on this particular button as soon as you click on button uh, it will load those uh, two students into the page so here you can see we added two students that is test contact one and test contact two so by default they are marked as to present but we can mark it as absent or as well as excused i can put the uh, comment as well uh, similar to the one we developed earlier so this is just an extension so that uh, you will get uh, oral functionality same as previous so here you can mark the staff members as well so let's submit this attendance and as soon as, I'm, as, soon as you click on uh, submit so the attendance will get submitted for that particular class offering so if you again click on this particular button you will get the error message because today's attendance is already submitted so let's go to that particular class offering screen so i just click on the uh, link over here so here you can see uh, under the attendance section 
uh, we have got the two students uh, basically and the attendance date is basically the created date so it's the today's date so now uh, we have put the attendance so now let's go to the home page and track what how the dashboard look likes so it's still not loading so yeah i just refresh this particular screen uh, button so here you can see there is one absent student and one is present so this is to showing the weekly data so here uh, we just mark the one contact as the present and one contact as absent okay so uh, so event offering so here you can see the two tabs under the track attendance one is class offering and one is event offering so under the event offerings this will be the global event that uh, where the all the students from every ca any classroom can attend this particular event so currently there is one test event and same if there is a description it will show the description over there and as usual there is a button called action where you can track that as attendance so similarly i click on that and i guess this uh, one event is created by you so once I click on it, it's showing me the pop up with two students to mark the present absent. Uh, similar that we create a, uh, did for the class offerings as well. Uh, you need to do the same step. So these are the two tabs for this will this must be convenient for your uh, users to track the attendance. So here you can get all the offerings. So uh, please let me know if there are any changes on this particular screen so one more thing is now we track the attendance but how i can check the attendance for that particular student so uh, suppose i want to track the attendance for the test contact one so i will go to the test contact one and if you scroll down there is a section custom link so under custom link there is a link view attendance report so you just need to click on that particular link it will redirect you to the particular report taking some time so it's the data is not available right now so yeah there was just no problem with that particular link i just fixed that now so as soon as I click for this particular test contact uh, link over here, it will direct me to the report for just for that particular uh, uh, student name, the student uh, actually. So here you can see we have just one attendance track for this particular contact which is taken on 7th of uh, 1st of July 2018. So here you can see uh, all the information like what the comment uh, input uh, we added for that particular uh, day for that particular contact. You can even edit, uh, uh, add the filters over here for that particular. You can set the particular. Uh, this is uh, the uh, dashboard or the report for the. Uh, current quarter that is from July 1st to September 13th. So you can set your own date over here or the criteria over here uh, as well as you can add more filters over here. So you can get all the information for that particular student as well. So even you are for the dashboards present in the home screen, you can uh, see the reports for them as well. You just need to click on. Uh, the, their links basically so if I go to the student management tab uh, and this is loading the report data and if you click on this particular view report it will be directed to the report with the, all the information present for the uh, this will be uh, available this will be for all contact students uh, into your system. So please test this overall functionality and let me know if there are any concerns. Thank you.